Sorry, pal. We're out of gas and your engine is boiling. Let's see if we can fix you up here. We'll be back on the road in no time. Stranded in the middle of nowhere. No juice. Dad used to say, a flawless establishment needs flawless window panes. At least the cold chain is unbroken. Hansen's ice cream. I used to love it when I was little. If it wasn't for the sand and rubble, the impenetrable darkness, the legions of bugs and that awful smell of gasoline everywhere, this sure could make a nice place for a picnic. Locked. Of course. Can you please let me in? I'm totally not a vampire, I swear. Tax investigation. Open the door. Meals on wheels. Your order is waiting. Hello? Anybody in there? I could really use some gas. I wish. It's frozen shut. Not a chance. I need to find some gas and engine coolant first. Terra Incognita Scenic Highway. Next town ahead. Long shot by the sea. Sounds promising. Does it ever rain here anyway? No way. A hidden replacement key. That was too easy. As if it wanted to be found. It fits. That was almost too easy. It's pitch black. I can't even see my own hands. There's something funny about that picture. switch. This must be the main fuse. This thing wouldn't take me far out here. Electrical cables. I know this image. Daytona Beach Race 58. What an event. The landscape on that picture vaguely reminds me of home. It's a picture of a buffalo. 
extra large, no refill. What I wouldn't give to be there. This is the end of nowhere. I wonder if these postcards would ever reach their destination. This one shows a map of the area. I'll take it with me. Quite off the beaten track. Cherry pie. If there's something I can't stand, it's cherry pie and hot coffee. 20% bun, 5% cold cuts, and 75% cling film. Thanks, but no thanks. Looks dusty. All I have left are a few Deutschmarks. Pretty useless out here anyways. Coffee. If there's something I can't stand, it's cherry pie and hot coffee. Again, that ghastly tune. frozen shut. Now they are working again. Drink up. You must be dying of thirst. Fueled up, but the engine is still way too hot. Not until I have found a way to cool down the engine. At least the cold chain is unbroken. Toolbox. This loot box contains only some rusty pliers. My tires should still last a couple of miles. It's frozen shut. At least the cold chain is unbroken. Those pliers won't help me with that. Some of these constellations seem familiar. Or do they? Zip. 
cold as ice. Exactly what I need. There you go. Have some Kool-Aid. Finally, we can make off again. Oh, come on. Start already. It's that darn oil pump again. Looks like we'll be stuck here for a while. sure this is the right place. When's the next bus back to the city? Beverly, I have arrived. I feel spewn out into the most barren, dark void of Europe. All things considered, this could most likely be the best vacation ever. Feeling chilled out already. The next city is like a thousand miles away. Ah, yes, that's where I am. The bus stop. My gateway to the outside world. Its heydays are over. Paddleboat rental. One hour, one Deutschmark. 
Hades, paddleboat rental, souvenirs, fishing supplies. Closed. A hiking map of the region. The upper section has been torn off. Trubber Brook, county of Broken Landa, one kilometer, or 0 0.621371 miles. I wonder what that is. Arrived at destination after a short walk. Trubberbrook, a tranquil little town. Seems a bit run down. I must say, Beverly, I absolutely fell in love with this town already. Wooden fences always remind me of my old neighborhood. That is one strange looking cat. That's probably the town's landmark. There's a selection of local charcuterie on display. Wurstebrei, Stippgrütze, Schlag de Platte, Potoka, Tote Oma. The Mysterious Village. Who is into this kind of stuff? Beverly, I discovered the local movie theater, Mobius Palace. The favorite genres around here appear to be Western and Noir. The Time Traveling Machine. Complete nonsense from a quantum mechanical perspective. I should check into my room first before I start exploring the town. This must be the place. Small ads, postings, announcements. They're holding a town fair soon. Exciting. Evening. Nobody there, huh? Doesn't seem so. The door to town square. That's quite a few fishing rods they have there. Hello? I'm not going to give up. Good afternoon. How can I help you, darling? Um, there's a room reserved for me. You know the, the lottery? I won a stay over here. You won? How can you win a stay in Trüberbrook? Well, actually, I don't really remember taking part in any lottery myself. Yet I received this winning notification. What was the name again? Hans Tannhauser. T. A. N. Tannhauser, Tannhauser. Eleven Hauser. 
Oh, oh, Dr. Hans Tannhauser. Oh, yes, here we have it. <laughs> Say, is it a quiet room? Seeking some peace and quiet, uh-huh. Well, I'm working on a text and I could really use some serenity. Text? Are you a kind of writer or something? I'm a physicist. Right now, I'm writing a paper on quantum physics. I've heard worse. You arrived just in time for the big anniversary celebration. Trüberbrook is a bit noisier than usual around these days. But apart from that, I'd say you have nothing to worry about in terms of disturbance. Here's your key, Dr. Tenhauser. My name is Trude, by the way. If you don't mind, where are all the other guests? Let's put it this way. The season in Trüberbrook is already over. I get the impression the season has been over for some time. just disappear with my paper? Something unusual happened. There was an uninvited guest in my room tonight. Now that he's escaped, I'm going to chase him down. At least it seems the burglar didn't rummage through the cabinet. Hanging dead animals on your wall is a bit eccentric. What a mess. I don't want to mess up the crime scene. It seems rather unpleasant outside. I better not, it'll start raining in. What is this? Some kind of goo. I don't want to go back to bed. I'm on a mission. Creepy. Some kind of a sea monster. Must be a local myth. Where did he go? This leads to the rooms. So many rooms. So few guests. Reception opening hours. Monday to Saturday, 12 p.m. to 6 p.m. Sundays and legal holidays, 12 p.m. to 4 p.m. I wonder what tomorrow's menu will bring. The traces lead outside. Darkest night. In the pale starlight, this village appears to be composed of jagged silhouettes and loneliness. It's the window to my room. Hey there. Taking a little night stroll? Someone was in my room. You only just got here and you already have secret admirers? No, it was a burglar. I think. Well, I haven't seen anyone sneaking around here. But if I were you, I would probably follow these somewhat extremely obvious footprints. You've got a point there. Please excuse me.
The situation is growing aggravating. I followed the person who stole my notes into a kind of dead-end street. And now he's vanished. Picture me standing here at the edge of the world, stripped of my writings. I wonder who on earth would steal a paper on quantum physics. I wonder if she knows something about the burglar. Do you like ghost stories? It is said that a proto-Germanic cult used to live up here in the mountains. They prayed to the spirits of the forests. I know it's a long shot, but maybe this visitor of yours is one of those spirits? This guy wasn't really a ghost. Or was he? Nonsense, I was just trying to mess with you. What was your name again? Tenhauser? Name's Gretchen. I'm an anthropologist. In fact, those old proto-Germanic ritual grounds just so happen to be my special subject. One of them is supposedly somewhere around here, though I haven't been able to find it yet. Gretchen, well met. Now that's all well and good, but what am I going to do without my notes? You know what? I'm going to help you track down that burglar. It looks like he escaped with one of the old gondolas. I bet he's hiding somewhere in the mountains, which incidentally is also where I was heading. Come on, you're a scientist. You're coming with me now and you're going to help me find this ritual site. Who knows, maybe you'll even find your evil spirit there. The one with an interest in quantum whatchamacallits. You scratch my back, I scratch yours. So what do you say? You with me? I... Ha! I knew you had the spirit of adventure in you. Are you ready to go? I'm ready to go. The early bird catches the warm and all that. We have to find a way up the mountain. It would be easiest if we used a cable car. I reckon that's also what our friend thought. The cable car doesn't exactly appear to be in pristine condition. What do you think? Don't worry, I'm sure I can fix this. I can't fix this. The master key is missing and a weasel damaged the electric mains. Maybe it was the burglar who did this. The plan. I'll hold the position and try my best. Why don't you take a look around town? We need the master key for the cable car. Also, we need to override the broken mains. Think you can remember that? I'll try to remember. Let's go. This is going to be fun.